2017 Kia K900 review. With great standard features, an elegant cabin, and a low starting price, the 2017 Kia K900 is one of the best values in the luxury large car class. New for 2017 Blind spot monitoring and rear cross traffic alert become standard. Pros and cons Upscale, comfy interior Excellent standard features Smooth ride Less expensive than many rivals Lower fuel economy the 2017 Kia K900 has a smooth ride and delivers the relaxed, quiet driving experience that a luxury car should. Its standard V6 engine is sufficiently powerful, and its optional V8 is strong. Both are matched with a well-behaved automatic transmission. Though comfortable, the K900 isn't as agile as some of its class rivals. Instead. It biases ride quality over sharp handling. The 2017 Kia K900 comes standard with a 3.8-liter V6 engine that puts out 311 horsepower. A 5.0-liter V8 that produces 420 horsepower is available in the V8 luxury trim. An 8-speed automatic transmission is standard with both engines. With the V6 engine. The K900 gets an EP estimated 17 miles per gallon in the city and 25 miles per gallon on the highway, which is below average for the class. The V8 delivers an even lower 15 miles per gallon in the city and 23 on the highway. The K900 SV6 engine provides adequate acceleration. The V8 has plenty of power, though some class rivals offer stronger engines. The 8-speed automatic transmission delivers quick, silky gear changes and makes sure there's plenty of torque when you need it. The Kia K900 comes standard with rear-wheel drive. All-wheel drive is not available. The K900 suspension provides a smooth, comfortable ride and enables confident handling. Its brakes deliver ample stopping power. The K900 doesn't steer or corner as sharply as some of its sports-tuned rivals, though. The 2017 Kia K900 has a stunning interior filled with premium materials. Its build quality is excellent, especially considering its low price relative to class rivals. Both rows of seats are spacious, and the rear seats provide a limousine-like feel for passengers. The 2017 Kia K900 seats 5 and comes standard with leather upholstery, power adjustable front seats, heated and ventilated front seats, and heated rear outboard seats. Available features include upgraded leather upholstery, front seats with additional power adjustments, power reclining rear seats, ventilated rear outboard seats, and a heated steering wheel. The K900S cabin is quiet. The front seats offer many angles of adjustment, making it easy to find a comfortable position. Both rows of seats offer plenty of room, but the rear seats are especially spacious and luxurious. Standard features in the 2017 Kia K900 include a 9.2-inch display screen, the Uvo infotainment system with voice recognition, navigation, HD radio, three USB ports, Bluetooth, a 14-speaker audio system, satellite radio, front and rear view cameras, front and rear parking sensors, a proximity key, push-button start, Drizzen automatic climate control, a panoramic sunroof, blind spot monitoring, rear cross-traffic alert, and adaptive headlights. Available features include a 17-speaker Lexicon audio system, a head-up display, a surround view camera, lane departure warning, adaptive cruise control, forward collision warning, and automatic emergency braking. Despite the many standard and available features, 
The K900 still lacks some amenities that class rivals provide, such as a rear seat entertainment system. The infotainment system's rotary control knob is fairly intuitive, though the on-screen menus are complex and may frustrate some drivers. On a positive note, the available Lexicon audio system delivers impeccable sound. The 2017 K900 has 15.9 cubic feet of trunk space, which is about average for the class. A power trunk lid is standard. This cargo capacity matches well against rivals like the Acura RLX and Cadillac CT6 14.9 and 15.3 cubic feet, respectively, but it falls short of the Audi A7 hatchback, which offers 24.5 cubic feet of space. We'll